people always need to be suspect of people when whether they're meeting them in person, out in public, or if it's over the internet, or you know what have you. Well, tonight police need your help finding this man. Detectives say he's accused of sexual misconduct with a minor. Police say the incident happened at a park in Lafayette. CBS 4's Lindsay Eaton talked with investigators and has the latest now on this investigation. It's heavily traveled, heavily used by the, our citizens, and we like to keep it safe. A place meant for fun, Columbian Park in Lafayette. This park is where police say a sex crime against a juvenile happened. It is concerning. Back on December 5th, DCS contacted Lafayette police about a sexual misconduct case involving a man and a juvenile. Police tell us the incident happened around 6.30 that night near the zoo. It's incredibly important to catch any sexual predator uh, in, the, in the community. Lafayette police tell us the incident happened here at Columbian Park. One of the biggest clues investigators have right now is a picture of the suspect that was caught on surveillance cameras. The prevalence of predators is always out there. So. Ian O'Shields is a sergeant with the Lafayette Police Department. With the case still under investigation, police aren't releasing a lot of details. They aren't saying specific information about what happened, and they aren't saying the age of the victim or if the victim and suspect knew one another. One thing police are sure of, they want this man off the streets before there's another victim. This is uh, an example of parents need to make sure they're having these conversations with their kids of be wary of strangers, again, whether it's in person, whether it's over social media, and there are bad people out there with, with bad intentions. Detectives are following up on some leads. Police are hoping someone may recognize this man from the surveillance picture or possibly was in the park that evening and may remember seeing him. Any information is good information. I always say that we're not as effective as we can be without the public. You know, there are eyes in our ears. In Lafayette, Lindsay Eaton, CBS 4 News.